we begin a new month, our pastor, Dr. Brad Winnier, speaks of the ultimate vacation spot, complete with streets of gold, in this revisited From the Shepherd to the Sheep. Welcome, my name is Tyler Candy. I am the media director here at Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. We're so very thankful that you have decided to join us today. And we have continued to see some outstanding results on our social platforms. We are growing at percentages we have not even thought of. We're up 400% on our subscribers. We're up thousands of percent on Instagram and Facebook. We're so very thankful for this great impact that we're able to have. And it's only because of you and your help. So will you share this with somebody? Will you subscribe to our YouTube page, like us on Facebook, Instagram, and uh, follow us wherever you listen to your podcasts. We're all over the place, so you just gotta find us. So let's listen as our pastor speaks on heaven. My neighbors on the right are headed to the mountains. My neighbors on the left are headed to the beach. My boss is taking off a month to visit all of Europe. I haven't got the time or funds. A trip's just out of reach. But I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. Talking with the one who died for me who shed his blood to set me free. He'll explain all the things that I don't understand and he'll show me the prince in his nail-scarred hands. I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. My neighbors on the right, well, they all caught poison ivy. <laughs> My neighbors on the left got third degree sunburn. And my boss <laughs> ran out of money and flew home from Europe early. One day I'll hear the Lord call, come up higher, now it's your turn. And I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. No, I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. Talking with the one who died for me, who shed his blood to set me free. He'll explain all the things that I don't understand, and he'll show me the prince in his nail-scarred hands. I cannot wait to take my vacation, walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. Walking on the streets of pure gold, Walking on the streets of pure gold Walking on the streets of pure gold With Jesus someday No sunburn No poison ivy And no debt Praise the Lord I cannot wait to take my vacation Well, I wrote the chorus of that song About 40 years ago maybe longer, and just added the verses the other day. And I believe it's a, perhaps a humorous way of putting the priorities in their proper place, don't you think? This is Pastor Brad Winnegar, and this is from the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotions. And today we're talking about something that folks are doing more and more of these days. They're going on vacation, they're taking trips. And while there's nothing wrong with that, 
the greatest trip we're ever going to take is the trip to go home to be with Jesus. I'm looking forward to it. And whether you can afford a trip down here or whether you're just waiting for that ultimate vacation, we'll be walking on streets of gold with Jesus someday. We'll be talking about things that we need explained, but mostly just enjoying His presence. It says in Revelation chapter 21 and verse 21 in the middle of the verse, and the street of the city, speaking of the new Jerusalem, was pure gold as it were transparent glass. That has intrigued me. You know, gold gets clearer and clearer as it becomes purer and purer. So it would stand to reason that the streets are paved with pure gold and are transparent like glass in glory. Looking forward to that. Most of all, it's Jesus that'll make it heaven for us. I don't know where your heart and your mind are right now, but the more and more we get closer and closer to that time, the more and more our heart should be in love with Jesus and the more and more our priorities ought to reflect that. So I'm trusting today that if you know Jesus Christ as your Savior, you're going to put Him first in your life and you're going to be looking forward to that ultimate time with Him in glory. In the meantime, let's get other folks ready. Amen. Let's pray. Father, we thank you right now for that wonderful expectation of heaven, walking on streets of pure gold with you. And thank you for salvation, Lord Jesus. We love you today. With heads bowed and eyes closed, if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Savior, then right now, for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Would you pray right now with me? Something like this, dear God, I admit that I'm a sinner and I deserve to pay for my sins. I want Jesus to come into my heart and take away my sins and take me to heaven when I die. And if you prayed that prayer and you truly meant it, won't you let us know? We'd love to help you out in your Christian life. And uh, those of you that are soul winners, keep at it, folks. Jesus is coming back. Father, we want to thank you right now. I pray for each one here, for the sick, for the hurting, for those that are facing great challenges. Thank you, Lord, that that folks can travel, but thank you mostly that wherever we are down here, we're away from that home up there and looking forward to it. Lord, we're homesick for heaven, looking forward to when we go. Thank you so much for that reality in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Well, I cannot wait to take my vacation walking on the streets of pure gold with Jesus someday. God bless you today as you serve Him. You are listening to From the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotionals. This is a ministry of Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. If you would like to learn more about our ministries, you can find us online at cbcwoodbridge.org. You will also find many other helpful resources there, including preaching, devotionals, and songs. We thank you for listening to this devotional, From the Shepherd to the Sheep.